Uh, hello, you've come for some hints and tips on interviews. Yes, that's right. So, how am I doing? How are you doing? Yes, be proactive. What in? Interviewing you or me? I don't know, you tell me. Uh, do you want the job or not? You're obviously not the sharpest tool in the box. Aren't I? You're here, aren't you? So, let's have a little practice. Pretend I'm a man giving you advice on how to perform in interviews. But you are... You should be pretty good at it then, shouldn't you? Come on, give me a complaint. Make something up. Oh, right. Well, the food's pretty awful here, isn't it? Is it? I thought it was quite good. The bacon wasn't undercooked or anything. Does that matter, or shall I make it up like you said? Well, uh, if you can't make things up, how can you ever expect to impress in an interview? By my CV? I've seen your CV. Your CD is much more impressive. I haven't made a CD. No, pretend. Make it up. Oh, but... I don't wear any makeup. One with a face like that, you should do. OK, if you haven't got a CV, what about forging it? I don't have a forge either. No, you have to pretend. Frankly, mate, you've no chance. With a CV like yours, the only thing you could possibly do is teach maths. Teach maths? Yes, no skill required. You'll walk it. Walk in at 8.30, say, turn to page 37, do the questions, mark them yourself. Leave at three o'clock and drink, and in between, drink coffee, eat biscuits and flirt with the art teachers. The art teachers? Yep, look at their day. You walk in at 8.30, say, get a piece of paper and draw what's through the window. Leave at three o'clock and between, drink coffee, eat biscuits and flirt with the maths teachers. And that's your hints and tips on interviews. You don't seem very professional to me. Oh, terribly sorry. Please excuse me. I thought you were here to train to be a politician.